Hello, my name is Stephen Clark, and for the next 12 to 16 weeks, I'm going to be following a training program and a diet plan in order to try and look as best I can for the summer of 2015. Just want to give you a little bit of a background on me. I've been training in the gym and eating healthy for the last year, year and a half, something like that. The gym that I go to is called Hybrid Fitness in Belfast. Um, it's great if, if you haven't heard of it you need to check them out to get them on Facebook. I think they're on Twitter. Um, I'll put all the links down below. But um, I've done different types of training programs with uh, Hybrid Fitness. Um, so strength training. I've actually just finished competing in Strong First TSC, Tactical Strength Challenge. Um, and, and different types of courses with Hybrid like their High Evolution course which is a 12-week program giving your nutrition, training plans, something similar to what I'm doing now. And I found that I got great results with that program and I think it had something to do with the structure and the how strict it was um, not only with the, the training but with the food. So this is why I'm going to be doing this style of training and eating for the next 12 to 16 weeks. I've always been a strong guy um, and I understand that you've got to build strength as a foundation. Um, but I, I've, I've always wanted to look well. I've always been a heavy guy. Um, I've gone from being 19 stone and now I'm sitting at around 13 stone. I've always been a big guy, been strong, but I've never been happy with the way that I look. Even now, it's taken me <laughs> losing a lot of weight, uh, getting healthy, getting strong in the gym, but I'm still more self-conscious than I've ever been in my life. Um, and this isn't the last push, but it's it's an attempt to see how well I can look. Um, I think I'm in at around a healthy weight. I don't want to go much lighter. I don't mind getting a little bit heavier as long as I look the way that I want to look. Um, and this is what it's all about for me. To try and get that lean, muscular beach body for the summer. Okay, so today's date is the 17th of April 2015. And it's a Friday. I want to be starting this program on Monday, that's the 20th. And basically I'm going to use the next couple of days to prepare for Monday. So that's things like making sure that I've got the right food in the house. Um, on Sunday I will do a meal prep. It will probably not be a meal prep for the entire week coming. But it will be for at least half of the week. And that way I'm prepared I don't go towards the fridge and look anywhere near the chocolate. I don't go looking for crisps. I have food sitting at hand. Um, the other thing is I've got a couple of rules that I'm going to play by. Now these are just things that I think are going to help motivate me. Things that I think will help me stay on track. Um, and it's things like, the first, <laughs> for example, the first one is looking in the mirror. Now I've said before, I've, I've not been happy with how I look, even now after losing a lot of weight. And I think one of the problems may be that I look at my body on a daily basis in the mirror. So what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to take a photo right after this video. And in three weeks time I'll take another photo of my body and compare the two. And hopefully I'll see the difference that way. Um, change is hard to see when you're looking on a daily basis so hopefully with those three weeks in between I'll train hard, I'll eat well and I'll notice the difference in those photos. Another thing that I'm going to do every three four weeks is check in my body fat percentage, my weight and my measurements so things like my arms, legs, chest and waist um, and I'm going to compare that and put it up alongside the progress photo so that you can see my body and you can see the numbers that go with it. And the reason for that is there's a lot of people who are so focused on weight loss and for me it's not about weight loss, it's about fat loss and muscle gain. Now they fund it. 
the fun part of three week intervals, the cheat meal. <laughs> this is basically just to make sure that I don't lose my mind. Um, you know, when I say cheat meal, I don't mean going out and getting a Chinese takeaway at McDonald's, anything like that. I mean something that you can do that makes it feel like you're having a treat. So it could be going out to a restaurant for a nice steak and a glass of wine. And that is good eating. That's eating clean, you know, good steak. All right, it might be fried in some sort of oil or butter that wouldn't normally be on your diet. But, you know, it's about still having a social life and still feeling like you can treat yourself every once in a while while being good with your food. Um, I'm, I'm going to have that once every three weeks. And, yeah, that that's basically for sanity. Um, you don't have to do it. If you don't want to do it, I feel like I want to do it because it want I want it to be something that I can sustain over a long time. So I feel like I need that cheat meal every three weeks to kind of boost my motivation. This, you know, to say only another week until I can have a glass of wine with a steak, and then once that's done, go okay, that was good, earned that treat get into the gym, get back on track with the, the diet and then it's only another couple of weeks before I can do the same sort of thing again. Okay, so this is just a, a brief introduction um, to what I'm planning on doing. Um, the next time you see me, it'll be Monday and it'll be me getting into the gym, talking about my mood, how I'm feeling, my motivation levels, how strong I feel. Um, and those types of things and, and I'm just going to have this as like a, a kind of diary um, I'll post it up maybe every week, maybe every two weeks something like that, I'll try and figure it out as I go along um, but yeah, thanks for watching this and hopefully you enjoy it I'm learning along the way, hopefully you learn something along with me so see when it all gets started